Hello all. This tutorial will demonstrate how to draw a section view in AutoCAD. According to a video from the National Design Academy. A section is a cut through of a space that will show more of the room's features. It also allows you to show some structural detail. A section line can be cut from any part of the space, depending on what you would like to show. Additionally, the Designing Buildings Wiki informs. A section drawing, section, or sectional drawing shows a view of a structure as though it had been sliced in half or cut along another imaginary plane. In this tutorial, students will practice drawing a building section based on Eames House, House Area, the Section AA Drawing, the South Section, and your space planning includes furnishings, fixtures, and equipment that you designed. Step 1. Open your CAD file for the Eames House project. Step 2. Copy the first floor plan and second floor plan to the right side 100 feet. This step is optional, but I prefer to save the original plans, and it is to use the copied plans for creating a section view. Step 3. Confirm that your current layer is zero layer. And then, draw a section line, recommended to use poly line, on the first floor for a section view. The line should start and stop outside of the plan, and you should add a small perpendicular box to indicate the direction of the section view. Update the section lines to the ANO layer. Copy the section line in the same position for the second floor. To copy the section line, you can rely on a column grid line. For a section line, you can break and offset the line to focus on crucial interior and architectural elements. Step 4. Draw a perpendicular line from the section line on the first floor to indicate the building boundary and drawing boundary. Step 5. Insert the section drawing by clicking Insert. Click Attach. Select the file from your project folder. Click Open. Click OK on Attach Image window. Click a base point and the second point to insert the image. Adjust image fade to 50. Mouse right click on the image. Click draw order. Click send to back. Step 6. Relocate and rescale the inserted image to fit the building boundary for the section lines. Note. You must use the object snap F3 appropriately when you adjust the scale. Sometimes the object snap works perfectly to click the CAD object. Sometimes the command does not work to click a point in a raster image. Step 7. Now, you are ready to draw the section with the inserted image. Note 1. You will rely on the dimensions on the inserted image, the lines on your floor plan. Use numeric values to draw lines. Please, do not just click on the image except for the spiral stair. The image is a reference only because the scaled image is always a bit off. Note 2. Create three new layers. ALWT object 0.2 mm, the edges of objects and represent a change in depth. ALWT section 0.5 mm, the layer is for the lines that representing the boundary of anything cut through. 
ALWT surface 0.05 mm, the layer is for detail lines on an object. They do not represent much, if any, change in depth. Note 3. Use line. Pline, spline, circle, trim, offset, fillet, extend, and stretch commands for draw this section. Note 4. You also update the line type manually for door and window openings. Note 5. First, you draw the guidelines. You are using X line for creating a line of infinite length. Then you draw the section lines. After that, you draw the object lines. Draw surface lines for details. Finally, you add furniture, and you should edit and remove the details and objects hidden from the front of the object. Note 5. First, you draw the guidelines. You are using X line for creating a line of infinite length. Then you draw the section lines. After that, you draw the object lines. Draw surface lines for details. Finally, you add furniture, and you should edit and remove the details and objects hidden from the front of the object. Step 8. Move the section and the section lines you drew, except the inserted image 100 to the left. This process is for saving the section drawing in a safe drawing area. Step 9. Create a block for the section. Select all the elements in the section. Type B for creating a block. Define the name 000 underscore section AA. Click OK. I hope this tutorial clarifies how to draw a section plan in AutoCAD. Thank you.